Hi guys, are you here in this one? I'm gonna be talking about Hardops bevel and how we can control individual bevels using Hardops. So let's grab a cube and let's put some bevel on it and drop some weight to normal so it looks you know a bit more civil. And we're going to grab a box cutter and we're gonna grab a, a regular box cut, cut it, press B for bevel and shift click to shift it to life and now let's say that we wanted to adjust one or two bevels not all of them on this cutter because when i go to q and bevel i can adjust a bevel all right but it adjusts the whole thing so i can you know reduce the number of segments i can make it into a chamfer or a bevel but I adjust all of them at the same time what if i wanted to have you know uh, two of them at a different size of for example chamfers and two of them regular bevels well, let's go to local mode and go to edit mode and in edit mode you can see that um, these edges are marked by hard ops as bevel weighted edges which means we can adjust the bevel weight and you can do it through hard ops menu so select both of them go to q and when you alt click on mark you can actually move your mouse uh, left and right and adjust the bevel weight of these bevels you can reduce it to zero right and then you could select these two edges and control B and create a chamfer. Or you could go to select one edge, go to um, Q menu and control click on mark, which will create another bevel, separate bevel. So you're gonna have two bevels running on this cutter right now, right? Uh, you get a main bevel and another bevel. So it's, it's, it's becoming more complicated, but now you can adjust all of them. So you can press Q and go to bevel, then press Q again and adjust this bevel. So this is how you can control bevels in hard ups. When you're gonna add a mirror to it, now this bevel is gonna be mirrored to the other side, which means you can actually control both of them at the same time. Press Q and you can control these ones, right? And this is very useful for creating, for example, end gun cuts, <clears throat> where you have this uh, end gun cutouts, like uh, I'm gonna show you. You know, something like this, for example, right? Let's select this cube and create something like this okay and then you got the you know you go to bevel and then let's say you do want to cut it in like this but you want to have different angles on different you know different parts of your uh, angle and cut so the same method you just go to um, edit mode select edges you want to control i'll click on mark you know and now you can adjust the size of them which is really convenient right well, that's it for this one, guys. Hope you enjoyed the vid. As usual, links to hard ups and box cutter in the video description. So if you want to buy these add-ons, go and grab them through the links. It's gonna help the channel as well. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.